it is one of the large departments of this university, not only large, in terms of activities also, it is very much reputed and vibrant. We offer three programs, namely BTEC Biotechnology and two postgraduate programs, MSc Biotechnology and Environmental Science and Technology. The job market of BTEC Biotechnology is yet to be structured in our country. I strongly believe as it is emerging field in coming days, there will be more investment, there will be more outsourcing, there will be more biotech based companies. So I strongly believe the job opportunities are going to be increased. Apart from pursuing PhD program, some MSc Biotech pass out students, they are inclined to join many corporate sectors and I know many of them, they are doing exceedingly well in some privately managed companies, corporate sectors. You know at present environmental technology management, it is a huge concern globally. So our academic programs are at par with this type of requirements and the pass out students of MTech, they join many commercial companies, R&Ds, because you know every, at every place they require one environmental person. Also some of them, they offer academic jobs. But as for the policy of Thapur University Patiala, we bring changes to our syllabi time to time. For every two years, every four years, we change our syllabi. During change of syllabi or courses, we take the expert opinion from different peoples of this university and outside of this university. It helps us a lot. The meaning of biotechnology is very broad and very extremely diverse. For example, we are trying to grow in the area of animal biotechnology, in the area of pharmaceutical biotechnology. We are trying to grow in the area of bioinformatics. You know, today, functional genomics, proteomics, these are very emerging areas. We are trying to catch that also. In the back of our mind, we are thinking so that we can introduce some new courses which have quite relevance to the society. Most of the, or majority of the, our faculty members, they are awarded a lot of fundings, a lot of R&D projects from different fund giving agencies. So largely our faculty members involved in many areas of research, for example in the area of plant biotechnology that includes crop improvement program, plant tissue cultures, plant microbe interactions. Apart from that, we are also involved in, the, in studying bioremediation, food biotechnology, natural products, isolation of different type of active principle from natural ingredients, environmental biotechnology, nanotechnology, biopolymers, environmental management and studies. So number of that is in other words, we are involved with the faculty members of this department are involved in various type of activities. We encourage students to come over here and uh, I definitely believe they will be enjoying this program. Thank you.